Hello, <laughs> this is Anime Life. Stacey's over there eating fucking biscuits. Hang on. There she comes in a fucking dress. Puppy's been Yay! trying to reveal her. Turn up my fucking skirt, did. I just had a nap, so yeah. Rude. I look more Asian than usual. Yes, I got this through today. A week late. Look at the flipping state of it. Like Jesus Christ. What did they do? It's a good job. Hopefully it doesn't have a cup in it. Mm, fucking well, I've already peeled that back. I haven't looked in it yet though. Because I can't be arse thingy in that game. Yeah. That, that looks so wrong there. <laughs> fucking oh my god. How tight is this box? But then yeah, it has been crushed in. Ew, it's Ooh, something purple. Oh, Zodiac Wars. Mm. That wasn't that good an anime. I predicted what the fuck was going to happen all along. What is this? Jun Tenso. This is that anime I showed you about. Oh, yeah. Zodiac Wars. Where I predicted every character that would die in order because, hey ho, it didn't have any originality. That's probably going to get copyrighted. <laughs> It didn't have any originality. You know who's gonna. As soon as episode two came out, let's say episode one, really, I knew who was gonna die. Stacey's Zodiac died first. Okay, it's a cup. Yay! This, one thing I want to say: this cardboard is very, very flimsy. Stacey's one is right there because she is the pig. <laughs> fucking slag! <laughs> Thank you, Luna. Stacey's not a slag, by the way. I thought I'd get home. So yes. Hi. Stacey's the pig, the big breasted motherfucker. No, I'm not. That gets killed first. I don't have big breasts. I like it though how it keeps kind of the ones that are the main characters right there next to each other. <laughs> and of course I'm there. That's me. That is mine. That is the rooster. <laughs> <laughs> Fucking horrendous how she dies. Probably go spoil the territory though. <laughs> it's another chip. Not like I ever uses. Thank you, Luna. <laughs> Thank you for helping me with this. Luna I love this. It. I love this help. <laughs> <laughs> Stop loving me. I'm trying to do something, darling. Yeah, the quality of this stuff is going downhill. Look, look at that. That is so shit. It's. It looks like it's been printed off on a really shitty computer. Mm. That's terrible. The quality isn't that good at all. It's like the box. Yeah. So the camera probably can't get the quality of it, but there. Well, then that's pretty good. much the camera is the what the quality of this is. It's like shit. a really shitly printed thing. There's mine again. She got crisps. <laughs> so yes, your one's there. Oh yeah. Your one. Uh, it seems that's the first episode. Your one gets killed first because awesome. because hey ho. It followed the most typical route any Zodiac type one could follow. I predicted every character that would die because all you kind of have to do is know the Chinese Zodiac to know which one's going to die next because it was that original. The ending was a disappointment as well because it was like all these people died and the person that wins the Zodiac Wars because it happens every 12 years Naturally. they get to have one wish. So the person that wit has it he has like this power where he can see every outcome, like everything he does, he knows the outcome, what it's going to be. So if he says something, that's what's going to happen, he says that thing. So he manages to manoeuvre around the whole thing just by this power of his, because they all have powers. My one has the power of birds, of course. What about mine? Your one has massive fucking machine guns. Yes! <laughs> I, oh yes! Holy I shit, fucking machine guns. That, that is... Because that totally awkward me at all, would it? So, yes. And they end up, like, wishing that he would forget about the whole thing. So it's like, all these people die so you could have this wish. So you and forget about you decide to end up just going, do you know what? I wish that I didn't know about it. Because he knows that if he said, whatever he says, he's going to end up getting killed because of it. Mm. So every time, every, like, thing in his head is going, do -do -do -do, like, he's going to die. He says that. Oh, oh no, no, Elity. This is Elity, you yeah. see just by that. That's a pretty purple. These peppers. Very pretty. Oh, well, okay. <laughs> this is the se like the second Elity. Mm. 
earthy type thing. Battle Angel. This manga is as about as old as what I am or older. Wow. I'm younger. Yay! And it didn't get finished until like recently. Because it had like this series that went on and it only had like a volume released every year. Wow. It started in like 2001, ended 2013, and it had 13 volumes. So yes, Elity. I don't like the design on that though. <laughs> it would have been more thingy if it was just like her on that. Or her final form. Her final form is like a fucking... She has this cat suit type fucking thing. Hmm. Oh, I saw that one. No, who do? Hey, it's Ninja Academy. That's actually fucking cool. The thing is, I don't like wearing these socks because they end up getting ruined, don't I? Yeah. No tissue opinions. Especially yes. when the one thing I don't like about this anime loot is that it seems to just be biased against a lot of stuff. Mm. Like I haven't seen a single fairy tale thing out of this. It's been two years now, not a single fairy tale thing. Mm. It's like fairy tale is big shit. Yeah. I say no. It's, I got a scarf. Yeah, I did get one thing. Scarf. The yeah. fairy tale scarf. That was like in the second one. That's but like you'd think more. you'd think that there'd be more. So yes, we have the academy suits. I don't know what to feel about the way that the loot's getting because it seems to be getting really, really fucking thingy. It's looking quite cheap. Yeah. It is. Oh, it's Land of the Lustrous or Crystallis thing. I watched one episode of this. <laughs> Not your cup of tea. It's just I start anime and then because it continues like one episode every week, I end up getting bogged down by other shit, so mm. I end up missing it. So I end up not watching it, which means it ends up building up. And it finished, like, it was, like, winter, I think, 2018 anime. So that finished in January. It's about, basically, these characters are crystals. Mm. And they're fighting these kind of Buddha gods to revive other crystals to make other crystal people. Okay. And then they end up shattering and they get glued back together. <laughs> it's very confusing. No, I'm all. My fire was blocking your face there. How nice am I? I know it has quite a big fan base. Is this going to be robots or supernatural thing? Supernatural. The Goblin Slayer and it's a novel. <laughs> oh my god, how small is that fucking writing? What is... Like, seriously, it's got a massive bar there, a massive bar there. And you could make the text Surely bigger. The text could be bigger. Look at that bar and look at that. Jesus. It's Usually a these... paper. That's nice though. You got some colour. You usually have like a colour little thing in these. Mm. And then sometimes you have like drawings. Oh, lovely. You gotta respect the booty. Dead Look at that detail booty. Dead ass. It's even got the panty lines. Well, uh, attention talk, to you know, detail. Attention to detail, yes. And of course you always have a glossary of what the fucking characters are. And usually sometimes they do... There it is. You have the, like, every now and again, within a chapter, you'll have, like, a picture. There we go. And it, sometimes it's the most meaningless picture. I read the novel of um, Grisham Girl, I think it was. I can't fucking remember what it was called. But I read a novel of Attack on Titan. Mm. And that, instead of you showing you, like, oh, yeah, a really cool scene where something's actually happening. It'll show you a really shit one where they're just sat down discussing someone. It's like, it's like, yeah. Yay! So good. That's another novel that I'll have to read. <laughs> what is this? Oh. Oh! Is this another Zodiac Wars one? What is this? What the fuck is this? Oh yeah, I won't be doing my Rooster Teeth Gold ever again because they unsubscribed it and now you have to spend $45 on getting the other one. What the fuck? Wow! That is kind of Claymore. shit. Claymore. I've never read Claymore, I've never watched Claymore. That just looks shit though. Yeah, it look, it's on really cheap silk material. Yeah. They seem to be running out of ideas, I think. But the thing is, they shouldn't. 
because with the amount of anime that is out on the market there's plenty to choose from yeah the one thing is though it's the new summer anime that has started this month mm. and the thing is even if it is the new summer anime they still have the manga to draw inspiration from for the stuff so they could literally do boxes and all that based on like certain things like that like what summer anime is coming out i know it's based on a certain theme i don't know what theme this month will be because it's fucking mixed Shit. Will it be Pride or something? Because I know Claymore is Pride because she fights and all that shit. <laughs> Naruto is Pride, Alethi is fighting for whom humanity. Okay. It might be Fight for Humanity or some shit like that. I have no idea what this is going to be. I'll find out though after I pick up this from the court. Let's have a look. Okay, also we've got the box. I ever get a poster as well of Jun Tensei. The box is fucking damaged. Oh, it was action then. <laughs> okay. It, it might be action then. I'm not sure. Usually they have quite detailed boxes. Yeah, that's. This month though, it's like, no. I'll just give it to you on a plate. Terrible. I like it how she's, like, usually when they do a poster, they do a character of most relevance at the front. No, yes, it's at least relevant on this time. Well, she fucking day is so. Well, damn. It is. It's action. That's it. You'd think I'd hide. I'll be holding this upside down, but I'm not. <laughs> if you if you want a thingy story, uh, really just, I'll just watch this for the fucking sake of it type story. Then watch the anime, but the thing is, if you go, if you're going in there looking for an amazing piece of artwork, then Look no. Away. The thing is, they use uh, the animation's quite solid. Like the animation's fucking amazing when they do the pig, because she's jumping about everywhere. She's got a machine guns. They actually use three D. They use three D for her when she's doing the scene. They use a lot of three D in it. Even in the opening sequence, you can see it's three D because they're turning round, yeah, and all that in the opening sequence. So it's a lot of 3D with 2D pasted over. And of course, it is Akron. So you got Alithi. You have the pins. Bad knees. You get a pin now. We used to have like a pin with the theme on it. But now you don't. You just get a thingy pin. Naruto sucks. Now. Nah. And Go. you got the Juntense. Cup there. And of course, Claymore cloth. <laughs> oh, Jesus. Awesome. And the manga down the bottom. Oh, oh wrong one. That side. <laughs> that side. <laughs> that side. I know what I should do. Mm. Is there a fucking wrestle crate out? So it's kind of like this. <laughs> Obviously, it's all wrestling stuff. Yeah. Then I can actually look clever when I'm so I can be like instead of just me being like, uh huh, okay, awesome. <laughs> I can be like, oh my god, right, this one, awesome. Well, the thing I don't like about this, it seems the quality is dipping in stuff. Yeah. Oh, no, the quality is certainly dipping, and it's not like they're running out of stuff to do, because there's fucking like probably ten different manga that come out every week, and they have other stuff improving on that. It's like why don't you get some stuff that is really relevant? Because Jun Tensei I've heard of, Goblin Slayer I've kind of heard of, I haven't seen it majorly published though. It's like it's good that they're getting that low-key stuff out there as well. Love it. Kind of like, say, like, indie stuff. This is actually the winter anime, as I said. So, I'm guessing they're putting in the winter anime. Because this was winter 2018, and I think that was winter or autumn 2017. Mm. They both were. I think they both came out around the same time. I only actually kept up with that one. <laughs> Naturally. I think it was them times here that they actually came out because there was a load and I think they came out together Of course you got that I don't like this silk of this. I don't I don't even know what the fuck this is made for What is this? Put it on your I, f I forgot to have a look at what it actually was because I am not sure Is it just a hanky? Is it a hanky? It's a waste of fucking thing if it is Bandana 
How the fuck can you use that as a bandana? It would rip. Yeah. Oh, have fun with it. Oh, we'll have fun ripping the fucking thing. <laughs> oh, God, I haven't folded that right. There we go. I folded it right now. Yay. So, yes. The fucking weird bandana thing. Put that back in its bag. Never Who'd to be seen again. Yeah, never to be seen again. We well, don't want to see that shit. I have actually hung the other ones up there. <laughs> Jesus. Oh, is that one that hurt the spot up there? Maybe. <laughs> There's one behind you that I got. It's the only one. Unless it's up, no, it's up there. There it is. Mm -hmm. The only one that I got with like one of the first ones. It seemed to have repetitive type themes. Like, I've had... I think four pairs of socks, three bandanas. <laughs> of course, you get a t-shirt with everyone. Yes. I'm not, I'm not fussed about that. It's a t-shirt. I got this one with one, one of them. Yeah. Just although, Ooh. never heard of fucking hypersonic. Never heard of it. It's probably a rip off of Vocaloids. Pfft. More than likely. Mm -hmm. Of course, you got the t-shirt. I still don't get why they didn't use the actual thing for that. It's kind of relevant, but it's kind of not because the live action of this came out recent, let's say, a few months ago. Mm. So it would have made more sense to thingy it around that time to like endorse it or some shit like that. Like, oh yeah, this is coming to cinemas, of course. We got the fucking kip. The kip. Bamboo fiber cup, one piece. Shit. Why does it put one piece on it? It's a fucking cup. Of course, it's gonna be one piece. Well, you, ne you never know. It could have put them in many pieces. Oh, I can't. Look, I can't look at that, it. though. Uh, the cardboard's so bad that you can actually see the lines. You can see it on the fucking top as well. Like, really? Oh, shit. You can see the lines. The cardboard isn't that good. It's a bit disappointing, that is. Oh, made in China, no fucking wonder. 2018. Trademark. Like there is actually like I think a novel out of this, so the novel actually might be better. Do you like him? Nah. It's so fabulous he is. He's wearing uh, yeah, it's just like yeah, underpants. Absolutely. And do you know what the thing is though? He also wears red high heels. Fabulous He's a necromancer. Necromancer her skill was communication. His skill is fucking predicting shit. You got the Fire and Ice Brothers, which is the snake and the dragon. You got the goat, which is the old bloke. It's Daniel Bryan. He won a past uh, Jun Tensei. Of course, you got the Inu, which is a fucking pig. I can't remember what their names are. It was that unremarkable. I can't really remember their names. Of course, you got the tiger, the rooster, the dog, and the ox. So I think, yeah, his his thing was bombs. His was strength, of course, because he's a fucking ox. His was every bloody canine ability, basically, because he could sniff shit out and all that. Hers, controlling birds. So you could sniff your right out of your asshole. Uh, hers was getting in a drunken haze and going fighting crazy. <laughs> and his was swords. Are you sure that's not me? I don't get why he's on the front, though. But then again, I guess he could get the most scream time out of all of them, even though he's not the main character. It was just... You couldn't really root for any of them, really. It gave you a bit of backstory to each of them. And the thing is, it shot itself in the foot by showing a backstory of the character that was going to die that episode. So it was like, okay... Here's that's your good backstory, then. and guess so, what, dead. So oh. you had 12 episodes, 12 backstories. There's so many other things that I've done it. It's kind of getting an unworked formula now. Something like that should never be 12 episodes. It can't fit it all in 12 episodes with the amount of characters that are in it. No. It's like my whole shoujo site. Apparently the manga goes on way further. Mm. And there's a lot of stuff in the manga that don't happen in the anime. There's like the anime end, end up having an alternative route, alternative ending. I really need to read the manga. So you end up with a unfinished work. I hope Happy Sugar Life isn't like that. I hope it gets full episodes. Like, full episodes. Because I don't want it ending up kind of demolished. Like, Nism interrupted. And the fact it was done by a fucking twat-ass studio that went, yeah, do you know what? 
they're going to do really shit animation for this and really shit drawings. Like, some of the screens, oh my god. The only good animation in it was probably them kissing. Naturally. 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 There's been a lot of disappointing anime art recently. And she's snoring. Can you hear it? Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, she's she's up there behind us. You can see it. You can just see a shadow. She, don't know why, but I thought she's in one of those fucking holes again. She ain't gonna sleep in the asses, she because this weather. Mm, Too it. fucking hot of her to sleep in them asses. Yes. So yes, this was anime loot. This will be the June one, even though it's July. It'll be the June one. And of course, it came a week late because why fucking not? Because yay, thank you, Postman, and thank you for bringing it in such a state. Like seriously, I don't know what the hell they do to this. That. I literally just throw shit around there, don't they? Look at it. That isn't a little dent. That's a massive fuck off dent. It's a good job it didn't have any breakables in it. Make sure you don't show the bottom of it. <laughs> I'll sure we're getting a fucking visit. <laughs> I won't, because I'll be at work. Hey, she in. I've stolen a cat. Like, yeah, I'll fucking put the cat back out. So I'm, coming to, I'm coming to fucking kill you, cunt. No one problem. hurts my pusses. My Anyone pusses are mad. They won't think that they're just headpieces. They're like, oh, what's Donald Trump's fucking hair doing in there? <laughs> Go fuck yourself. She had a bloody war on Facebook last night showing pictures of her fucking rats. They're not rats! They are rats. They're not rats. And they are part of the rodent family. They are rats. They are guinea pigs. <laughs> they are rats. Guinea pigs! They were used as food. <laughs> You'll be used as food in a minute. So you can fucking catch me first. Ha 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 ha! Hey, we. It's real It's like my sister fucking out when. I used to just set her off because she couldn't chase after me. I'd be halfway around the other side of the bloody court before she even got to the gate. <laughs> oh, it's so funny. I stole a Lamborghini once and she chased me and she couldn't catch up with me. <laughs> she thought I chucked it in the bin. Olivia went on with it. She went, you put it in the bin. And Tash went and looked in the bin for it. It was hidden <laughs> in a <the> cabinet. <laughs> yep. Okie dokie. This has been Anime Life with the Ansel okay Werewolf. Hi. Because she's fucking here for some reason. I don't know why. I don't know why this stranger is here. I'm just awesome. She's fucking I have weirdo. to be everywhere, damn it. She creeps through the dog flap every night. You should see. It's like a scene out of the grudge. <laughs> as, I say, <laughs> as I say, tries to creep through it. She only gets one foot through it and gets stuck and then we have to call the police. <laughs> they let them back in every time anyway, so. Yeah. It's fucking weird it is. Okay, I'm no. weird anyway, so. Check out Stacey's channel you want. Although she hasn't updated lately. Hey, I live streamed last night, damn it. Accounts. Sure. So. Sure. You need to update more videos, really. If you can get your yeah, laptop, we can. Well, a laptop works. Or just stream it from your PlayStation. It works. It's charged down there. Because you can actually save videos and then put them up then. That way. Yeah, it's just having the thing to do. It's just like, yeah, yeah, this is what we do. Yeah. <laughs> Okay. <laughs> and if you like, you like it, comment it down below. Or subscribe if you want to help the channel grow. Hit the bell. Hit the bell as well. Twat that bell. Hit the bell. I got hair on me. It's I'd say twat the bell, but then that would be kind of weird. Jeez. Each to their own, I guess. <laughs> I have to make it weird. Each to their own. I have to make it weird. I'm okay, and for now it's time to say goodbye. I'll see you. Hey, since you're here, why not check out another video? You can do VAG videos, gameplays, and unboxing. I also do DeviantArt, Twitter, and Twitch. And a lot of live streams, so remember to catch me live if you want to see more of my craziness. Also, remember to subscribe to come on Animu Lifer. That's the Animu Lifer for life. Also, remember to like the video and turn on the notifications so that you can get to see my videos first. Bye! 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 Bye!